Sweden first knocked off the United States and then bounced Japan to snag a spot in the semi-finals of the Women's World Cup. The Swedes, the World Cup runners-up in 2003 and three-time third-place finishers, eliminated previously unbeaten Japan 2-1 in Friday's quarterfinal. With Japan out of the tournament, this year's World Cup will crown a first-time winner. The sold-out crowd at Eden Park, where Sweden will play in the semi-finals on Tuesday against Spain, danced to songs by Swedish rock band ABBA as it was played throughout the stadium after the win. Amanda Eilestit scored a first-half goal and Filippa Angelbel converted a second-half penalty to give Sweden the mild upset and send the Swedes to the semi-finals for the fifth time. Obviously we were very happy with the win against the US, but we knew we had to recharge and think about Japan, midfielder Kosover Aslani said. We knew we were going to play a very skilled and technical team, and we didn't want them to have a lot of time on the ball, because that's when they're the best. Japan had been so prolific with 14 goals in rolling to a 4-0 tournament record, but the Japanese struggled for most of the game to keep up with the taller Swedish team. When Sweden went up 2-0 late in the second, Japan seemed out of the tournament. But the Japanese finally made a late comeback and seriously pressured Sweden goalkeeper Zesira Musovic, who was fresh off a World Cup record 11 saves in the win over the United States. Riko Ueki's penalty attempt for Japan in the 76th minute hit the crossbar and bounced clear of the goal, but Musovic was finally beaten in the 86th minute when substitute Hinoka Hayashi's penalty cut Sweden's lead to 2-1. That was all the Japanese mustered as Sweden advanced to play Spain, which beat the Netherlands 2-1 in extra time earlier Friday. Japan had beaten Spain 4-0 in group play. Sake Kumagai, playing in her fourth World Cup and Japan's captain, was in tears with the rest of her teammates following the loss. We fought so hard because we wanted it, she said. We want to go to the next round, of course. We will come back stronger. Japan's exit means there will be a first-time winner at this World Cup. Japan won in 2011, and previous winners Germany, Norway and the United States were all eliminated earlier in the tournament. Eilestit broke through for Sweden in the 32nd minute off a free kick that ricocheted among the players in front of the goal before landing at her feet for the goal. It was the defender's fourth of the World Cup. I thought, backquote I'm just going to put it away now, Eilestit laughed. So that was a great feeling. Angelbel added the penalty kick in the 51st minute after Fuka Nagano's handball in the box was confirmed by video review. Japan's run in the World Cup ended with 15 goals, more than any team left in the tournament. Hinata Miyazawa finished with five of those goals to lead the Golden Boot race, matching the team record set by Homer Sawa in Japan's 2011 title run. The team grew and the players grew out of this World Cup. We were able to demonstrate that on the world stage, which is a fact. We also lost this match, which is also a fact. But the players, their work at this World Cup, is something that we need to assess positively, Japan coach Futoshi Ikeda said. Sweden was riding high after eliminating the two-time defending champion Americans on penalties following a scoreless draw on Sunday. The victory came by just millimeters, when goal line technology showed that Lena Hertig's attempt crossed the line before it could be saved by American goalkeeper Alyssa Nair. Japan, number 11 in the FIFA rankings, earned a place in the quarterfinals with a 3-1 victory over Norway. The game was a clash of styles from the start. Third-ranked Sweden was more physical while Japan was more technical. Sweden dominated possession for much of the match and had the better chances. Angeldal's penalty appeared to rattle the Japanese, who struggled against the taller and more athletic Swedes. Japan didn't get a shot off until the 63rd minute. Japan had scored at least twice in each of its previous games, but had never come back from down two goals in World Cup play. At the Tokyo Olympics, Sweden eliminated Japan on home soil in the quarterfinals. Sweden advanced to the gold medal game but lost to Canada. The Swedes have never won a title at either the World Cup.